goals in six games, plus the assists we talked about as well since the end of that 18-game goal of Stroud. And that line starts against the Matthews line as this one is underway. Glad to have you with us on Talos Flames Hockey on Sportsnet. Tromped up the boards. Nylander there to clear. Shillington popped it up the carpet, trying to get in. Tanev back. Pat saved by Markson as the puck deflected on goal. Markson got the right leg out to make that stop. Well, for either team, really. And there's Kerper with a great stick. Gets a nice opportunity. Tavares. Matthews, Riley, Nylander, Morgan Riley, here's Matthews, down low to Marner, stopped by Marcia, and the loose puck's cleared up. As the penalty comes to an end, Coleman takes the puck with the draw going towards the goal. Coleman over to the goal, and the pass goes deflected away. Now the Flames are covered to go, in time, stopped by Campbell, and Shillington gets the puck. Johnny Gaudreau, in tight with a look, still waiting for our first goal on Sportsnet. Leafs able to clear it all the way down with 15 seconds to go in the first penalty being served by Tavares. Flames back on the attack. A shot. Here's Monahan. Shoot. Stopped by Campbell. And he's able to hang on. It's, it's a different kind of game. Much more free-flowing. And the Leafs like to play that way as Riley's on the puck. In front. Can't save Markstrom on the redirection by Marner. That was a nice stop as he got the left leg down to make that save. From the point. And he gets the puck. He goes directly to the goal line. And he spots Marner. And he gets... Body position does Marner on Shillington, and that's a real nice. Leads the rush to center. Lucic carries down the wing on his offside. Pass in front. Stopped by Campbell on the redirection by Monahan. And here's Juan Lucic with a beautiful pass, backhand pass right onto the tape for Monahan. That's the best save of the game for sure by Jack Campbell. And just prior to that, even Morgan Ryan. Although everybody likes wins. Yeah. And we'll go back to Sandine. Here's Tavares with a bit of road to the circle. Shoots. Stop. Rebound. Stop two. Pass in front. Anderson makes the save. Sandine scores. March from two saves. Rasmus Anderson at third. And then Sandine able to open the scoring. And make a one nothing draw. Okay, Markson is going to play the puck behind the net. And take a look at Sandine at the point. Watch this play. He's going to get the puck back to Tavares. And now the danger starts. There's Tavares. A fantastic chance. A better save on the rebound than Rasmus Anderson. A beautiful save. But everybody's just in scramble mode at that point. And finally the puck's going to come back to Sandine. And through traffic, somehow that finds its way back into the back of the net. Now Rasmus Anderson... Coleman on the puck, makes a good pass to back, but he's got some room. Oh, oh, back to the way, back to the front to Montepoy, he scores! Oh, 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 Twenty-four seconds after Toronto opens the scoring, the Flames tied up on a goal by Andrew Montepoy. Coleman does a wonderful job getting to back with, now this is high skill, the backhand pass, no look. And Mangiapane, a beautiful high short side shot. He doesn't even look at the net, Mangiapane. In fact, I think now look at it again, that may get the stick of all. Hard to tell, but man, nonetheless, that's a great response by the... Uh, Toronto's up to 26 shots, and we know that Daryl's big on trying to keep pucks out of the net, but Toronto's look dangerous. Nylander cutting in front, jabbed away by Armstrong. This puck comes to back, but he'll have a chance to bring it out. It does. Pass to Matthews, who feeds it over to Marner. Back to Matthews, skates it in. Marner, Matthews, stop by Armstrong. Matthews trying to get it in front. They do, but it goes across the crease and off the boards down the ice. Now take a look at the give and goes between he and Marner. It's just these two. The entire way up the ice, a quick one to the Here's Monaghan to Brett Ritchie with a bit of room. Ritchie shoots, stops, rebound. Stopped by Campbell on Monaghan. Second terrific save by Campbell on Sean Monaghan in this period. Face off one by Lindholm. Here's Anderson down the wing. Anderson in front. It's going to be hand and foot from Anderson. The two D-men make it 2-1 Calgary. Look, they win the puck back. Kachuk gives it to Rasmus Anderson to head up the entire time. And his D partner, Noah Hannafin, we should get a good look of it here. He just races down to the far side. Perfect take to take pass. That's exactly how you draw it up.
Flames over for four. Chance to build on this lead. Win to draw. Sillington shoots. Scores! Beautiful face-off win. Hannafin right to Shillington, and he just steps right into that one. What a what, great face-off win by Michael Backlund. Wow, you don't draw it up any better than these last two goals by the Flames. And then missed the net. As Tanev feeds it across. We approach the final four minutes of period two. Control again. Makes a pass. Little scores! Then take a look at this play. Tana, beautiful, right up the middle. Goudreau spots Lynn on the entire time. And then Lynn over that deceptive, deceptive release. Goes short side, and he easily beats Jack Campbell. You've got to have deception on your shot. There's no question about it. These goaltenders are too good. Marner on it. Turning from Tana. Backhand pass stolen by Mangiapane. And now Coleman leads the rush up to back. Oh, stopped by Campbell. Backlund got that shot away with a bit of room coming in off the right shot. Up play back to the line. Hannafin shot and Kachuk had to get out of the way. Is that deflected up high? Back to the line. Kept in by Anderson. Walks it across with room and a shot. Scores! It's 5-1 Calgary. Right here, it's a bouncing puck. Knocks it back to the middle. And now with traffic, you can see Jack Campbell can't barely see around it. And that is just a perfectly placed shot by Rasmus Anderson. There's not a big opening for Anderson to hit. And yet that is just beautiful to watch. Second chance for the Flames. Backlund puts it off Brody and out the center ice. Onto the puck for the bench is Dubé. Wheeling in on Brody. Dubé goes wide. And oh, got a shot away. Campbell's able to make the save. Lilligren with the pass that finds Bunting. And he plays it out to Matthews. And they work it in. Matthews Bunting takes a look with the shot. Scores! Well, there goes that theory right there. <laughs> Michael Bunting gets his 14th of the season. And the Calgary lead back down to three. And that was the key to it. Then they get the puck to Bunting quickly to Matthews. Watch this little drop pass back to Bunting. And from a really sharp angle, that is a perfectly placed shot right off the far post. And that gives the Leafs some life again in a game in which didn't look too promising about 30 seconds ago. Now all of a sudden, it's 5-2 and with the fire pop. Marner trying to pull the trigger. Good play by Tanner to bat it away. Brody, Matthews. Matthews with a nice move and a shot. Shoulder saved by Markstrom. Here's a shot for Bunting. Turned away by Markstrom. Rebound play to the boards. Tipped across. Muzzin shoots. Stop. Back in front of the post. And that was batted out of the air by Matthews. And right off the goal post. Muzzin with the original shot. Now watch Bunting in, out of midair. Austin Matthews knocks that off the crossbar. What hand-eye coordination. Phenomenal. In fact, I thought from here in the press box that that had gone in. But cleared, and that will do it. Final seconds wind down, and the Calgary Flames knock off the Leafs 5-2.